In today's video, we're taking a look at how to clean your countertop portable ice maker easy and simple. This is so easy, anyone could do. Everything that we use on the video, we're gonna leave a link on the description. So you feel like you need some ice in your life and you decide to go get your ice maker, but then you realize that you've been putting water on it for months and months and you never cleaned it. Don't worry, today in the Statabox team, we're gonna help you out with that. The first thing that you wanna do is disconnect your machine from the outlet. We're gonna remove the scoop and the basket, take it to the sink and clean it with soap and water. We're gonna create a solution that's gonna show that ice maker who's the boss. And this is a great DIY cleaning solution without chemicals, which means even if you let some behind and it turns to ice on this clear sunny day, you're not gonna die. And we're gonna use white vinegar. And the recipe is one cup of vinegar, one cup of water. So if you use two cups of vinegar, that means two cups of water. We're gonna start with one cup of vinegar, one cup of water. Now we can mix it well, and to make the cleaning process easier, we're gonna place the solution in a spray bottle. And remember, this solution is only to clean the inside of the machine. And we wanna use distilled water or filtered water. And a pro tip, it's always good to use filtered water when making ice, because with tap water, you can create more buildup in the inside or deposits. Now we're gonna go ahead and spray all the inside of the machine. And using a clean cloth, we wanna go ahead and clean the inside. This is a time when you take out that old t-shirt and put it to use, and preferably a clean one. We wanna make sure that we get every nook and cranny on this machine. For difficult to reach places, you can use a toothbrush. You can either use a clean one, your spouse one, your kids one, your roommate, but never use yours. And that was a pro tip. If you don't have a toothbrush to spare, you can also use a Q-tip. Now to clean the inside of the inside of the machine, we wanna take our remaining solution. If you don't have any more, then we wanna make another one and we could throw it directly on the ice maker's reservoir. We're gonna connect the machine and let it make ice. And this is basically going to help descale your machine and remove any buildup or deposits in the lines. But if you feel your machine is working good on the inside, you don't have to do this. We recommend descaling your machine at least three to twice a year. But cleaning with a cloth, it's always a good practice to do it once a month. Once the bucket is full of ice, we can discard that ice. We can remove all the solution that's left, clean the inside with water, and then we're gonna fill the reservoir with filtered water. And we're gonna let it make ice a couple of times to remove any taste from the vinegar. But because this is very diluted, one to one ratio, you should not have any aftertaste. Now that you show that ice maker who's the boss, you can go ahead and open that bottle of ice cold, sparkling, liquid gold, happy face making, move that body bottle of water. Don't forget, if you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up, that really helps. If you have any questions, place them in the comment section below. Either someone in the Slatterbox team or someone in the YouTube community can help you out with an answer. Don't forget to subscribe, follow us on social media. Thank you for watching and here's a link to our latest video.